packed right. and ready to go. Uselessly packed and... What is that case made of lead or something? He's grunting and all he has is a pair of socks and a toothbrush in there. <laughs> hey Rufus, you should save your energy for the unavoidable drop into the abyss. <laughs> yeah, thanks, Wenzel. You can save your sarcasm for someone less well-prepared than me. This time, I took everything into account. It'll be a stroll in the park. Ah, that's what you said last time. It took us days to remove the cactus spikes from your butt, remember? <laughs> that's all toxic runoff under the bridge. This time, everything will work out. And when finally an Elysian Orbit Pixie massages my back, I'll ask her to pause for a minute so I can laugh about you. Whatever. But say, can I have your stuff when you're gone? Yeah, sure, help yourself. As if anything on this dump is valuable. It's time for me to leave all this behind. Great. I hope you remember to calibrate the harpoon. I'll do that later, after I've stored everything in the pod. Well, then hurry up. Well, you know that the Organon are always on time. They said a bunch of words that I have no idea what any of them mean. Um... <laughs> But apparently, I can't tell if this guy's supposed to be our friend or supposed to be our enemy. He was in, or like a, a frenemy or something. He was in the tutorial that I just completely skipped because I don't need a tutorial on how to play a point and click adventure game. I'm a master at these. There's a wrench that we need for some reason. Um, okay. And a fuse? No, we can this just This will be at the it. most spectacular departure ever. Apparently, there's some sort of pixies in this game that massage your back and something called an organon I don't know um there's a pod and it seems to be chained to a rocket or to a control board that's connected to a rocket I don't know is he gonna try to launch himself as a seat <laughs> new problem why would I want to remove that oh crap it's screwed tight Oh, so we need to find a screwdriver? Um, fuse, harpoon, control rod. Well, there's not a, maybe there's a screwdriver in the storage space? No? Why would I even remove the Oh. Is he trying there. to fit his suitcase now in there? Where shall I put it? <laughs> okay. There we go. Whatever. Now let's put the battery if I remove under the, the seat. seat. It might just fit, but how's it going to be attached? Okay. And more importantly, where shall I sit? So we need to find a screwdriver. Doesn't look like there's anything else out here to interact with. Maybe Wenzel? Hey, Do you Wenzel, have a screwdriver? Any signs of Any the organon? Any signs of the organon yet? Whatever no, that is. but they'll be here. The organon are always on time. It's no accident that we set the town hall clock by them. Okay, what are the Organon? What else do you know about the Organon? Just as little as you. So that's really nothing. Perfect. Exactly. Their motives are as unclear as our water. Good thing they <laughs> leave us alone. All right. Um, do you think there are boundless riches? Do you also think there are boundless riches in Elysium? Don't know. I'm happy with what I got. Yeah, but I will have so much more. Aw, oh, poor, poor Wenzel. <laughs> Um, do you think no one has to work in the also think that no one- Just a moment. You're not even working now. Well, that's what I mean. <laughs> I'm meant to be up there. All right, we're done with- uh. And don't you think- I've never really understood why Tony and you aren't together anymore. Yeah, well, that's why you'll be rotting in this forsaken hole forever. I deserve better than having to listen to lectures about my laziness and my unreliability all the time. She's probably not with him because he's lazy and messy and stuff. Did that just move? Oh, there's a bug on that. Uh, about the plan. About the plan. Are there any pro blah, blah, no, blah, no blah, plan. blah, 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 blah. Um, no, no problems. Pro oh, Why? Okay, he doesn't have a screwdriver. I don't care. Back oh, to work. Bye. It. Let's go in here. I don't think there's going to be anything new in the house. So, let's take his lazy butt and go out front. Yay. Doorbell. What a terrible sounding doorbell. There's like a moving arm thing back here. Chili pepper. Ouch. Hot. Apparently it's hot. On the outside as well as the inside. Who are you? Hello, Hannock. Hey, um, uh, well, uh, Rufus. Ah! <laughs> I'm really terrible with names. Apparently our name is Rufus. <laughs> hey, Rufus. Okay, is the tunnel is closed the tunnel again? closed again? Yes, we had another collapse in Sector 7. 
Another junk slide? All this trash is really driving me nuts. I'm glad I'll be gone for good soon. Are Gosh. you? You bet. They just live well, in a big old junkie. I only know junkie. you won't be leaving through this tunnel. Okay. Uh, All right, you go. Yeah, bye. Okay. Mailbox? What did I get in the mail? <laughs> New problem. <laughs> oh crap! It's screwed tight. That looks like a bolt on the side, though, not a, a screw. It looks like a nut. Since it is a nut, maybe the wrench will work on it. Yay! Um. Well, I have a mailbox now. <laughs> for some reason. Anything else I can interact with? No. Into the house. Apparently you can double click and skip that. I don't know if I've been doing that. Uh, nothing new. Outside. Well, I found a new seat. So... Maybe since he said the same thing, I can unscrew the seat with a hmm. wrench. I might be able to do without this. What? Oh. That's where the seat was attached. I'll okay. need some kind of replacement. The mailbox? <laughs> Apparently. Ha! Uh, uh, huh. There you go. How silly. Oh. We can open the mailbox. Oh, I guess maybe we need to put the battery back in the mailbox? Doesn't look like it's gonna fit. Ha! There you go. Magic. There. The capsule and science. is ready. Now, all I have to do is calibrate the harpoon. Okay. Control panel. What do we have here? Oh gosh. There. Too bad the two directions of the control stick are blocked, but who needs those anyway? The main thing is that the crosshairs are right on the tracks. And then I'm gone. Ha! <laughs> this will be a walk in the park. Why don't you just remove the thing on there? Oh, okay. So that moves the 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 joystick around. Or the the harpoon targeting thing. Uh Hello? I have no idea what I'm doing. Maybe just keep doing this and it'll work. Oh. Okay. And. Nope. And. Nope. Uh. Hello? Oh, almost there. Almost got it. Alright. That. Nope, that takes it back to the same place. Okay. All right, we're getting there. Uh, we're not getting there. Oy vey, hello? <laughs> what am I doing? So bad at this. Huh? Maybe? <gasps> did I do it? Mm, nailed it. I did it! Now, I'll just light the fuse and <laughs> boom! It only took like three well, million years. Oh, Stand there's someone else there. Blah. Is that Tony? Hello? Hello. <laughs> okay. Tony, why are you sneaking around like that? This is still my house, remember? Well, it's not as obvious now since someone stole my mailbox. Oh, it wasn't me. Look at Wenzel with his fancy new telescope that just happens to be the same color as the mailbox. Rufus, it's almost time. Uh -oh. Yes, I know. Sorry, Tony, but it's over. Once the fuse is lit, I'll be gone for good. Hurry up and read the letter. Come on. If only that was true. Uh, gosh, there's just so much to say. Why are you here? Why blah, are you, blah, are blah. You still it would be a miracle if you finally disappeared for <laughs> real. But in case it doesn't work out again, I'll at least have the satisfaction of seeing you injure yourself. <laughs> okay, so apparently she doesn't like me or like Rufus at all, but she lets Rufus live in her house for some reason? Does Wenzel also live here? I only saw two rooms, I think. Two bedrooms. Maybe we sleep in the same bed and he does weird things with his goggles in the middle of the night. How does he see out of those? I don't know. Anyways. Uh, 
It's too late. You can beg all you want, but I won't take you no, along with me. Can I have that in writing? <laughs> There's nothing you could say to prevent me from going. There's nothing you- What a stroke of luck. That means I can't say anything wrong. She really does not like Rufus at all. This is the final goodbye. It's too early to jump for joy, I fear. I bet now you're sorry about some of the things you said. That's right. Starting with, you can stay with me. <laughs> All right. I'm leaving. We're out of here. Good. I gave up hope of that a long time ago. So we're going to go ahead and light the fuse. This will uh, be the Oh, there we go. Now I can get to my inventory the now way I've been trying to get counts. to my inventory. So we're going to light the fuse. We're going to run quickly. Hello. To the run quickly. Nope, just apparently slow. What's gonna go wrong? Because apparently everything else of his has gone ah, wrong. Well, maybe I should read the letter. <laughs> Dear Mister, yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, he reads things yeah, like I read things. Inform you, blah blah blah. Get to the point, will ya? Unfortunately, the delivery of your screws will be delayed for. Please find enclosed a voucher for a pack of rivets. We apologize for any inconvenience this morning. Uh, oh no. Did he not screw together something on the second? Screws. The tub that he's launching away in. <laughs> of course not. Was that tied to his leg? Why did he tie that to his leg before going off? She seems to be enjoying herself. Oh. Oh, well he's got tetanus. I'm pretty sure he's dead, right? Alright, well, that's the end. Rufus died in a horrible accident. Uh, yeah, so I think that's where I'm gonna end this one. Uh, so we finished all that first bit and got into space, I guess? Or on some sort of thing that was on a rail? I don't even know. Alright, thanks for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one. It's kind of pathetic, you get all erratic About dirty dishes congesting the sink I'm tired of your bothers, remember our fathers They dwelled in a world filled with rubbish and stink But when all hope was lost, someone raised from the dust He was handsome and cunning, his haircut had style Courage was shining in his eyes As he said, screw you guys, mind your own business I'm off now, goodbye Huzzah, he's off now, goodbye